I done watched them niggas do interview after interview They not culture vultures, the culture something they been into So if you never gave them a view, I recommend you do Cause when they question guests, they message is not subliminal It don't matter if you a rookie or at your pinnacle They gon' touch on stuff that you did and what you finna do It's uncensored too, yo they never Some crazy stuff happening, only, only Allah or whoever, you know, coulda, coulda did this mm-hmm. and- and and I, I was with it ever since. And right and right after I made that commitment, here come Ice Cube. Now Ice Cube is picking me up every morning and shit. I'm a nobody. He picking me up every morning from the east side from my neighborhood. And he's like, he's like the biggest thing out. So I was like, God damn, like it scared me. Like whoever this God was, this Master Bard Muhammad or this Elijah Muhammad, it was it was heavy, bro. So, you know. I stayed with it. I kept my word and, and been true to it ever since. And, and I, I, I ain't been able to find one lie in. I spent the first two years in the nation trying to find cracks in, in the fish tank, trying, trying to find mm-hmm. stuff that I could disprove. Yeah. And I wasn't able to find it. So I, I had to bang it and keep my word. You brought up Ice Cube, man. Shout out to the brother Ice Cube. I know you yeah. got a long history. Recently, yeah. taking some criticism for his, his part in, in a political campaign. I'm not going to dive into that too much out of respect to you, but just talk about Ice Cube and the, the criticism that he's taking. First off, how do you feel about his stance? And then how do you feel about the criticism that he's taking because of it? I, I support him no matter what. Like, I support him on a general scale. Like, I know him personally, so I have issues. I have personal issues with what I think that he could have, you know, positioned, he, you know, instead of a contract with black america the the noi who he i know he has benefited from and and still seeks the counsel of minister farrakhan you know the honorable elijah muhammad has already placed before congress and the united states government the the muslim program you know what i'm saying which basically says the same thing if you go to noi.org and then slash muslim program then you'll see those same points Hmm. so i'm like okay why you know my, my personal issue and like i said I'm, I'm riding with it no matter what but i was like okay well why you don't we don't need, we don't need to reinvent the wheel like if we feel like well, people you know they, they they don't they don't want to digest they don't like minister farrakhan i don't like the nation of islam okay well that's part of being a man you know if you really know this is this is good for our people you, you know we don't necessarily need to repackage it and reinvent the wheel and say somebody you know, because that that's making it look like you a novice. It's making it look like you just started this in July in the, in the, in the summertime of 2020. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you kind of make you isolate yourself and making yourself more vulnerable and, and not really a, a united front. If you're not standing with the foundation that people know you became conscious on. Right. Like, right. Stay with the stay with the, the team that, you know, is the is the winning team. And it's not that he didn't stay with it, but. You can't be scared to speak it. Can't be scared. That's that's why everybody is getting in trouble. You wasn't scared to say F the police. You wasn't scared to say them, them tweets that you posted that got them coming at you again. Yeah. Don't be scared to say I'm with Farrakhan. And I, this is the agenda right here. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying he was scared to say that, but he didn't say it for whatever reason. And these these, these so-called Jewish people is, is steady trying to air him out, saying that they steady trying to air Nick Cannon now they're trying to still air, air Deshaun Jackson out. They're trying to air uh, who else? Kevin Hart or whoever. Like any, anybody that that say something, they're gonna they're gonna push a a hundred percent full line against you. Mm-hmm. But so we can't be scared to push the same line back. Like, do you think Farrakhan is anti-Semitic just because they say it? Right, I right. know the definition of Semitic. Semitic means Afro Asiatic language. Mm-hmm. So how are, how are we Afro-Asiatic language when we are the Afro-Asiatics? Hmm. Langu- language don't create itself. Right. So if we are uh, anti-Semitic or anti-Black, that means we, we've we been programmed to hate ourselves and we gang-banging and killing ourselves because of y'all's program and y'all's Jewish media that said we was uh, uh, watermelon, buckeye, you know, buckwheat-ass slaves and shit. Y'all... The, the Jewish people did that. The, the, you know, the so-called Jewish people did that. So don't bang on us. Don't be scared to bang on that. 
that's what you know even with nick can that's my young bro you know what i'm saying his father's a real one from from uh san diego from bloods yeah but however you know don't don't get soft with with the people that just pressed you and, and persecuted you don't get soft and allow them to come on your platform and you getting soft and talking soft but then when you talk to one of us we talking tough hard language and shit now we don't nah, come on bro that like that's not that's not what we're gonna do here but he's a he's a real one don't get me wrong he's a real but he's trying to be sensitive for whatever reason right i'm not i'm not trying to be sensitive for no reason yeah salute that why, why do you think that ice cube didn't um Go with uh Farrakhan and uh you know, as you say, the Muslims um program. What's your because, reason behind that? You think it was maybe because of the controversy surrounded by Minister Farrakhan? Of course. Of course, the same way why Barack Obama didn't mention and, and and Minister Farrakhan went along with him and didn't mention that they was they was cool and they, they was in communication before he was running for president. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Minister Farrakhan is the real godfather. He's not gonna he's not gonna force you. This it take people like me. That's gonna that's gonna speak up and ride like like homie like why you ain't you know woo 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 and it's the far gonna be he gonna, if anything he gonna tell you yeah don't mention my name you know what I'm saying because I know you not cut like that because mm-hmm. anybody that's a rider you ain't gotta tell them to ride you gonna have to tell them now don't know this kick kick back like you know what I'm saying but if I gotta you know okay well then you you gotta you know you you you, you don't want to jeopardize something and I you know I'm not gonna let you use my name I'm not gonna let you use me as an excuse this is far kind of people like that talking to say that you know I I influenced you to to mention my name or to mention my organization and my program you know what I'm saying and then you catch some heat from it and now you can lay that on my doorstep like you know I'm responsible for that now do what you feel do what you feel I'm support you either way but people like me, that street dudes that I know these dudes personally, because you know I was the one used to 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 teach them and, and introduce them and and put the you know this with this and this with that. You can't shut me up like that. Farcon can, but I see I see everybody else being quiet. Like when when they crucifying Jesus, all all the disciples, all the people he helped is mm-hmm. is quiet and shit like a church mouse. Now I got a problem with that. I'm I'm not with that program. Definitely. Speaking of fair comment, let's let's talk about this now. Um, the the Vlad situation that happened. Um, people don't know the backstory. Um, pretty much, DJ Vlad, you know, misquoted the minister. Some people say lie. I use the word misquoted about uh, what the minister Farrakhan said about um, supposedly throwing a rock at Jewish people, which he never said. Um, right after that, you know, a lot of people it was like a firestorm of people that came out. And pretty much reprimanded Vlad, wanted him to apologize. You were one of those people. Can you kind of take us back to that time and um, how you feel about that whole situation? Yeah, I'm. I'm. You know, like I said, I, I'm nothing. Just, be, just so y'all know, I'm nothing. I'm just y'all little brother.